guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley at ts tech talks video in today's video guys i'm going to show you guys how to make use of signal app on your pc so um there are two things you need to do first you need to download signal on your mobile uh, on your mobile device and then you need to have signal on your pc as well and then um let's move over to the mobile device let me show you guys what you need to do in order to make use of signal on your pc now since you have signal downloaded on your device all you need to do you notice where it has this three dotted icon on the top right click on that and uh, you notice where it says settings go ahead and click on the settings now scroll down to where it says advanced or sorry you notice where it says linked device right go ahead and click on the linked device now it's going to show you this um option that um there is no device that is linked right you notice on the bottom area where it has this plus icon go ahead and click on that now if you click on this you can say um you notice it says um scan your qr display code on the device to link now um you need to scan this on the laptop area where you have signal so i'm going to go ahead and download this signal on this laptop version and then go ahead and make use of it so um to do that let's go ahead and open this url it's called signal.org but i'm just going to search it on google but if not this is the url right here all right so right here on your desktop or your pc go ahead and type signal.org this is the url right here signal.org slash en if you search it on google it's still going to give you signal now scroll right down to the bottom area where it says um download you can notice it has android it has iphone and then windows then depending on the kind of device you are making use of right now i'm making use of windows laptop so i'm going to click on the windows to start downloading the windows version now you can notice where it says download for windows go ahead and click on that button but i already have this downloaded so go ahead and click on that button to start downloading it once your download is completed now you need to install it after you've completely downloaded it so i think i already have it on my device so i'm just going to scroll down to look for signal up i have this downloaded already then i just want to make an installation of it it should be right here now there you go this is the application right there so to install it just double click to start the installation process now it's going to you can notice it has the signal logo on it right so you're going to give it some time to download and complete this download process so this download process is going to take a while to complete and just realize it wouldn't be that much so i'm going to pause this video while this download successfully install successfully i think it has completed now it's loading okay it's loading almost there now this is signal you can notice right here now this is the code that is requesting for us to scan so i'm going to go back to my mobile version and scan this also now let's move into the mobile version move it um on the device on the face of the device just like i did right here so once it located you, you can notice it says um look this device it will be able to read all your messages blah 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 and then just go ahead and click on link so once you click on link it's going to take a while and it says device approved now if you click on the linked device you'll be able to see it display but right now it's not displaying because i haven't completely finished the linking on my desktop version so all i need to do now is click on finish linking finish the linking on my desktop version so all i need to do now is click on finish linking now you can notice it says um syncing contacts and groups so give it some minute to sync the contact and group so it's going to take a while a um, maximum of two minutes to sync and it's going to complete in no time all right there you go these are all my contacts that has been synced successfully and when i scroll down i can see every contact i have on my phone that are currently making use of signal so anyone i want to um, communicate with all i need to do is to click on any of them and then say hi or chat them up so it's as easy as saying hello and then start the conversation on my device now i have signal on my device and i can make use of it anytime i want and if you notice on my phone it's actually going to say that a device is linked all right so after it successfully linked 
after you've successfully linked the account to your device come back to the settings area to confirm that the device is linked now if you click on linked devices you can notice that it actually showed the device that has been linked and how long the device has been linked and how long that it has been active so this showed that our device is successfully linked and this is actually the name of the device that is linked so if you click on it you can notice that it says um you can unlink this device by um by unlinking this device it will no longer be able to send or receive message so if i click on ok it's going to unlink the device so i don't want to do that right now i'm just going to leave it for a while but you know what for this tutorial please let me just go ahead and unlink the device so click on this area and then click on ok now you notice the device has been unlinked so if you check on the desktop version or on your pc version you will notice that it's no longer available so all you need to do in order to link this device once more is to do the same thing click on the plus icon and then scan it on your pc device so that is all for this video guys thank you guys for watching make sure you do like the video subscribe for more video and share with your friends peace